Hello everybody, thank you so much for watching and this is going to be a reading for uh, Virgo for October 2015. I have pre-shuffled the cards because I am noticing that um, longer videos are having a really difficult time getting to YouTube and hence they're a little bit late so my apologies. I am going to use two decks, uh, Psychic Tarot and um, Angel Cards for the reading i will use one angel card for the theme of october and i will use remaining five cards for the rest of the reading now when i do readings with clients one-on-one -on -one, i don't use any tools i am strictly uh, a medium at that point and i will literally have um spirit you know mom dad grandma come through and i will be literally repeating information that's being said to me verbatim um, as you can imagine, I can't do that um, on a video that is uh, based or uh, that is for many people at the same time in many situations. So I am resorting to tools. So which brings me to a point of um, cards themselves because I don't really read cards. When I pull a card and when you see the card, what I tell you the message regarding the card may not be the card meaning as per a book. So don't get uh, dissuaded by that. I am using this strictly as a visual cue to prompt uh, my intuition and to listen to my guide, okay? So I'm going to choose one from top. This is for the, um, for the reading um, month of October general theme. And one, two, three. And this is going to be, um, and a card flew out. So I have to pick that up. So I'm going to use this as the first card for the present situation. Okay. This is number two, number three, number four, and number five. Okay. So for a general theme for Virgo for the month of October, we have the card of the world. Wow, that's a great card. So I don't know if you can see it, there's a bit of a glare, but Archangel Michael, and it says, a job well done, joy, contentment, and gratitude, the path toward enlightenment. So I always ask uh, for additional information to um, what my guide wants to tell me about this card. Okay, so what I'm seeing, what I'm hearing is this is a time of celebration and a time of gratitude for um, a, a, a job well done. Now, I'm using the word job, but I'm actually being, I'm connecting to my heart chakra. And what I'm being told is that the job well done very much um, uh, pertains to self. So whoever you are, whoever this reading is for, whoever this resonates with, this is about celebration for a job well done pertaining to your sense of self, okay? This is very much about you. So that's the general theme. Now, what is present situation? Rejoice and celebration. Very consistent with the card we just had about uh, the world. And what this um, card is telling me is it has been a long time coming. I am being told that you have had to jump through some hoops, emotionally and mentally speaking, to arrive where you are, where you are today. And I'm seeing the number five, something with a period of five years. Um, Five months, not so much, not really five weeks, but I'm, I'm being drawn to five years. So it's a good chunk of time that has, um, this has been in the works to make you basically who you are today. And you are to be celebrated is what I'm being, what I'm hearing. You are to celebrate yourself. You are to celebrate your triumphs. 
you are to celebrate how far you have come with respect to who you are. So this is not about other people. This is not about jobs. This is about you, purely about the sense of self, okay? That's awesome. Now, in your past position, what you have is patience and waiting. And what this tells me is that you are coming from a place where you've had to do a lot of waiting and patience. I get the word patience. You had to be patience, patient. Um, I also feel that there was uh, waiting for the right situations to become clear for the right people to come into your life. Uh, very much an incubation period is what I want to say. Patience and planning. Now, it took a lot of effort and time to get to where you are today. And this planning and patience or patience and planning is very much about you have to work really hard on yourself and this reading is about you it's it's just very different than any other reading i've done today uh there was a lot of patience put in what you were doing and i get the word transformation this is very transformative time for you okay in your immediate future what we have is new beginnings well if you've transformed and you've come to a place of celebrating the new you, you're gonna have new beginnings. So very consistent. Um, however, with new beginnings, start, start new projects. So in other words, what I'm being shown is just because you have a new beginning and you've arrived at an amazing place in your life, this isn't the arrival this is only a stopover and when i say only i don't mean to say it in a way that minimizes who you are today and the work you have put to be who you are today but this is very much a pause work still continues okay development on yourself still continues it continues in a new way and in a more profound way and in a more um, a pleasant way.